Hello, 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 YouTube. How's it going? It's the infamous one of the call in every gamer, and we're gonna be giving you some awesome topic today. It is about the awesome, not really too awesome thing called a telemarketer. And I'm gonna tell you the two ways that you could handle them the right way and the wrong way, and then the in between way. Actually, that means this to me. But, anyways, let's go. Let's start it up. Let's do this now. Here we go. So, the first way you could mention to a telemarketer, or even know it's a telemarketer, is if they do something like this. Ring, ring. Hello? Hi! I'm here to tell you about... You telemarketer? Yeah! I'm gonna tell you about something beautiful that we have for you. It's called a deal. Um, ex ex excuse me, sir. I, I am a man. Yes, yes, I know, and you could maybe buy it for a wonderful lady or something in your life. N no, I'm sorry. I have stuff for that. I, I don't I, I don't need to buy that. Goodbye. That's the right way to um, uh, mess with it, to deal with a telemarketer, not mess with them. Um, that's, that's, that's pretty much the in-between-ish way, I guess. Um, the wrong way is to do this. Hello? Hi! Just shut it off. Just hang up the phone. It's not the right way to deal with a telemarketer. Because then they'll just call you right back. They'll be like, brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
from like India, China, and like all these countries that Americans cannot understand. Like I have so many people complain to me that no, they can't understand them. They don't know what they're saying. They like they have too much of an accent. You don't speak speak good English. Like if you're gonna hire someone, make sure they can speak English. Like come on, come on, let's do this. Don't be reading from a script. Be like a person. So. I, I don't really find that problem too much, but I've heard a lot of people who are like, I can't, I can't understand people on the help lines. They don't understand me. And then they just, I don't know. It's just a problem. I, I basically understand almost all accents, so I, I don't know. It, it's it's not that big of a problem for me. I understand quite a lot. Cause I've met quite a lot of different types of people, so I understand a lot of accents over the phone and like stuff so I don't really find that problem uh, I just don't like when you tell them stuff and they don't understand what you're saying they're like oh, excuse me I, I, I've never come across that problem before I'm like excuse me you work for the company you should know just about every single problem that could happen there is not one problem that you should not have came across yet because I know hundreds of people call you up each day exactly what I would tell them and they'd be like, yeah, but I never got that problem yet. And be like, oh, well, then give me someone that can fix my problem, man. I, I want to get back to playing video games or something. Come on, man. I got I got stuff to do. I gotta make monies. I gotta make my YouTube monies, which isn't a lot, but I gotta make my uh, gotta make my foods and get paid. So, yeah. Anyways, guys. So I guess that's it. Tell me, how do you deal with telemarketers, and what's your luck with the support systems of companies? Do you get people on the phone that you can't understand, so they need to hang up, and you gotta go through the process again for like another half an hour just to find someone that you could maybe understand a little better than them, or maybe you'll get the same person you have to hang up again. But tell me your situations and tell me what, uh, how you deal with them. All right, guys, this is Infamous One, the culinary gamer. Hope you enjoyed this video. It was kind of all over the place. But, yeah. Goodbye. Have fun. Peace out. Bos bos broski. There we go. That's the right word. Alright. Bye, guys.